What's up everyone? This is me Sean and welcome back to some more Skyblock from the Skydog server. Now, today you have probably noticed a couple changes by now just through that intro and yes, it's true I'm using shaders. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be using shaders from now on and I'm also going to be using this 32-bit texture pack which I really like. All right. So another thing is I built this farm which you know, it was intended to be in the last video, but I decided to go ahead and hold off on that and I added it on to the beginning of this video. And also, while I was, you know, preparing a little bit for this, a chicken spawned like right over there on the side of the island. So I decided to go ahead and save it and I led it all the way over here into this nice little cobblestone cage and I've thrown a bunch of eggs and breeded it a couple times and now we got a few chickens. So today, I'm going to try to make a chicken farm, as well as a couple other grass patches for animals to spawn on. And maybe if I have time, I'll make some sort of like house or something, I don't know. But, let's go ahead and let's start doing that. Oh yeah, also, I totally forgot, I can now actually complete a quest. So let's go ahead and let's do that. So you need, I think it's 32 wheat, 8 pumpkins, and 32 melon. No. Hold on, it's 32 melon, 16 wheat, and 8 pumpkins. Okay, so let's, nope, let's do slash quests. There we go. And then let's go to sky black. And now I can go ahead and complete starter farm. So, 32 melon. Yes, alright, 32 melon, 16 wheat, and 8 pumpkins. And now I can claim the reward of a jungle sapling and 16 doit. Let's do that, there we go. Very nice. Now I have some some uh, dirt, and I have a jungle sapling to go ahead and start with. For the chickens, I'm going to make a small little farm, like I said. So, I'm going to build off uh, over here, just beside the wheat farm, and I'm going to make a space oh, for the chickens to hang out in. So I'm just going to throw all this stuff back in here real quick, and then I'll mine all this, and then I'll get it. Because I don't want to lose stuff if I fall off. Because, you know, I've had blocks disappear from under me, and I fell off, and I lost all my stuff. And it was not a fun experience, let me tell you. It was an awful experience. Alright. Let's go ahead and let's start building. <gasps> Are you serious? Ah! <laughs> no! 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 It took me forever to get that. Oh. Okay, so uh, now to house the chickens, I'm just going to build this wall up one more. And there we go. I'm just gonna lay down a nice wall just out of cobblestone. Boom, and boom, okay. So for the front, I think I'm gonna just put some cobblestone walls because I have a lot of cobblestone. All right, there's a lot of cobblestone in this series. There's going to be a ton. All right, and then I will put the gate right here. All right, let's go ahead and let's do that. I'm sorry if I also just like did something weird with a pop filter or something, because the way I said, uh. Put. Yeah, whatever. Alright, I'm just gonna grab this. I'm gonna go place it down over here. Open it up. And then do this. Come on, chickens. It is time. It is time, chickens. You must come out of the water there. Yes, out of the water. You must come this way. Come on, chicken. You can do it. There you go. Good. Good chicken. Good guy. Okay. What about your little baby chicken? Oh, he got in here. All right, sweet. All right, see ya, suckers. Bam. <laughs> okay. Also, let's uh, just put this. Actually, that's not going to keep him in. Okay. Let's put the cobblestone blocks right here. All right. And then there. Also, right now, what I need is... Uh, wait. I'm missing one. Oh, no. All right, the baby was just sitting there. Okay. So... What do I need? 
I need torches. That's what I need. Okay, so did I make any more? No. Okay. You know what? Before I go ahead and I make a bunch of torches, what I'm going to do, again, is I'm going to build off a little bit and start making a little bit of a tree farm as well because I need a place to farm trees that's not right here and all of a sudden there's 20 frames per second. Why you do this, game? Huh? Why you do this to me? I do not understand. What is so laggy about this? What is going on? Okay. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Okay, shaders, are you going to act up again? If so, please say now. Okay, I don't think the shaders are going to act up. So, let's go ahead and let's go out and build that tree farm I was talking about. Because tree farms are pretty good and I need them. So, let's go ahead and let's make one. Oh, and by the way, I know I didn't need to put this uh, cobblestone layer under there, but I decided it was too wide, so I'm just going to go ahead and put it there for now. Deal with it. Okay guys, this is going to be the biggest it's going to get for right now because I don't want to just make a giant like little or a giant little space. Wow, yeah, I don't want to make just a giant huge space I'm not going to be able to put torches down on. So, I'm just going to leave it like that for now. All right, and let's also make some uh, charcoal, all right? Whoop, let's take that. And the 20 frames persist er, persistent. Yeah, the 20 frames per second is persistent. That's what I wanted to say. Okay. Welp. Oh, come on. One, two, three, four. Stop auto-putting it there. Okay? Alright. Oh, man. It's... Oh! It's the shadow updates, isn't it? Because the sun is setting. That's what it is. I'm a doof. Welp. <laughs> Might have to turn the shaders off. You know what? That's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to turn the shaders off and see if it... If it uh, persists or not. Well, I'm still getting only 40. No, it's not It's not the shaders. Okay, good news. I'm, I can keep the shaders on. Ah, oh, great. All right, guys. Well, the frames are back, and I'm also not the only one having frame issues. Yeah, no, this guy's having it too, but he says he's streaming, but I'm recording, but I'm pretty sure it's pretty much the same thing, but yeah, my frames keep going down too, man. I'm, I'm going to tell him here in a second, but... Yeah, we have made a lot of progress in this video. I have made a chicken farm, a self-sustaining a self-sustaining chicken farm. Also, make sure to keep your island lit. Alright. Uh, just wanted to go ahead and state that because reasons. But yeah, chicken farm done, tree farm done. Now the next thing I need to do is get a house built for myself. So, how am I going to build a house, and what am I going to build it out of? I'll make it out of wood, and guess what? Guess what else I'll make it out of? I'll make it out of cobblestone, because cobblestone, you know? So, I'm going to get grinding a little bit here, and I guess I will see you guys when I am f done grinding. Hold on. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get started on this house, but first... I wanted to go ahead and wanted to point this out, and uh, yeah, this is a little bit of a problem. So, during that little session, a big old tree grew. And uh, yeah, that thing's stuck up there now. You know what? I'm just going to leave it. It's a little mini floating tree island. I'm going to leave it there because I'm too lazy to go get that stuff. But, let's go ahead and let's start building the platform for the house and the little base for the house. So. Yeah, let's see. I'm going to build it. I'm going to build it over here. All right, let's go. All right, time to make this house great again. This house is going to be huge. It's huge. This block is wrong.
You know, I love this house. It's huge. And I made the Mexicans pay for it. It's huge. It's huge. All right. So <laughs> let's go ahead and take a look at the house. Inside. Outside. Inside. And outside. It's amazing. It's amazing. I know. Okay. So yeah, I just made this small little thing. It's a little bit of shelter. It's a little place for me to go because reasons. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to end the video off here because I am out of time to record. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, likes, favorites, and whatnot are appreciated. Also, make sure to go ahead and hit that big old red subscribe button if you haven't yet. And also, be sure to hit that bell notification right next to the subscribe button. What that does is it makes you uh, aware of when I upload by giving you a notification up on the bell icon on the top right. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.